Good day, learners. Today, we are going to discuss converting degrees to radian and radian to degrees. But before anything else, do not forget to like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so that you will be updated for my upcoming videos. In this video lesson, we are going to discuss converting degrees to radian and converting radian to degrees. To convert degrees to radian, just multiply degrees by pi radian over 180 degrees. To apply these two conversion rules, use the basic relationship pi radian is equal to 180 degrees. Degrees and radians are related because 2 pi radians corresponds to one complete revolution 360 degrees. Then we can say 2 pi radian is equal to 360 degrees and pi radian is equal to 180 degrees. Example number 1. Convert 120 degrees to radian. First, we are going to multiply now 120 degrees to pi radian over 180 degrees. First is we are going to cancel out the degree symbol and multiply now the 120 to the numerator pi radian. So it becomes 120 pi divided by 180 radian. Since the greatest common factor between the numerator 120 and the denominator 180 is 60. We are going to divide the numerator by the GCF 60 and the denominator 180 by the GCF 60 in order for us to simplify or get the lowest term of 120 over 80. So it becomes 120 divided by 60 is equal to 2. So our numerator is 2, 180 divided by 60 is equal to 3, so our denominator is 3. So just copy the pi in the numerator and the radian. So we can say that 120 degrees in radian is equal to 2 pi over 3 radian. Example number 2, convert 900 degrees to radian. So, we are going to multiply the 900 degrees by pi radian over 180 degrees. So, we are first, first we are going to cancel out the degree symbol and multiply now the 900 to the numerator pi radian. So, it becomes 900 pi over 180 radian. Since now 900 is divisible by 180, so we can divide it exactly by 180, then we can say that 900 degrees is equal to 5 pi radian. Example number 3. Convert negative 60 degrees to radian. So the negative 60 degrees multiplied by pi radian over 180 degrees, cancel out the degree symbol, and the negative 60 will be multiplied to the numerator pi radian. So the numerator becomes negative 60 pi over 180 radian. The GCF between 60 and 180 is 60. So when we are going to divide the numerator 60 by the GCF 60 that is equal to 1, and the denominator 180 divided by the GCF 60, that is equal to 3. So we can say that 120 degrees is equal to pi over 3 radian. Next is how we are going to convert radian to degrees. Just remember the rule. To convert radians to degrees, multiply the radians by 180 degrees 
divided by pi radian, which is now the inverse in converting degrees to radian. Example number one. Convert pi over 5 radian to degrees. So, this is now the given 3 pi over 3 radian. So, this will be multiplied by 180 degrees divided by pi radian. So, first thing is we are going to cancel out the pi and also the radian. It becomes 3 fifth times 180 degrees. So, the 180 must be multiplied to the numerator 3. So, it becomes 3 times 180 degrees divided by 5. So, that is equal to 540 degrees divided by 5. Then, we can say 3 pi over 5 radian is equal to 108 degrees. Example number 2. Convert 10 pi over 3 radian to degrees. So, 10 pi over 3 radian must be multiplied by 180 degrees over pi radian. Cancel out the pi and also the radian in the numerator and the denominator. Then, as we are going to update our expression, so it becomes 10 over 3 times 180 degrees. As we are going to multiply 180 degrees to 10, so it becomes 10 times 180 degrees. That is equal to 1,800 degrees divided by 3. Then we can say 10 pi over 3 radian is equal to 600 degrees. Example number 3. Convert 2 pi radian to degrees. 2 pi radian must be multiplied to 180 degrees over pi radian. So, cancel out the pi. Cancel out the radian. Then, as we are going to update now our expression, we have 2 times 180 degrees. Then, we can say 2 pi radian is equal to 360 degrees. Example number 4. Convert 3 radian to degrees. 3 radian must be multiplied by 180 degrees over pi radian. As what you can see in the given, there is no pi given. So that is why we only cancel the radian. As we are going to update the expression, that becomes 3 times 180 degrees over pi so, as we are going to multiply the numerator, that is equal to 540 degrees over pi. And take note that the value of pi, as we are going to convert this into degrees, pi is 3.1416 approximately. Then, we are going to divide 540 degrees by 3.1416. Then, we can say 3 radian is equal to 171.89 degrees and that ends our video discussion at this moment thank you for watching but before you will end this video please do assess your learnings by answering the self-test activity thank you